Hi, welcome to the Bureau and my garage studio. My name is Brooke. Right now I'm going to demonstrate a beginner Pilates reformer workout. It's a very classical order, so I hope you enjoy it. Okay, so I'm on second gear because I'm 5'9", so it's helpful for me to have a little more length. I'm going to work parallel, heels are together, or heels are lifted, excuse me, and parallel, shoulders on my back. I'm focusing on getting my, whew, my back ribs anchored without going into a tuck. I'm going to keep my neutral pelvis. However, my back ribs full on the mat. And I'm going to inhale, push out, keeping my push. I'm going to exhale, belly to back, resist the springs to come in. I'll do 10 more. I'm working on closing the carriage, cinching my waistline without losing my push. Keep building my posture with each repetition, adjusting my body when I need to. I transition on my arches. Again, same thing. I'm going to keep my tail, but I'm going to keep my back ribs anchored, back broad. Inhale, push out. Exhale, pull with my stomach. Exhale, pull with my waist. Always resisting the springs. Keeping my reaches through my crown, through my feet. Getting bigger and brighter with each repetition. So I'm changing onto my heels. Pulling my ten toes back, anchoring. Engaging, inhale, pressing, pulling. Never losing my press as I empty my lungs and cinch my waist. Exhale in and up my belly. Keep feeling my back of ribs, back scapula on the mat. Building my posture for two more. I'm going to slide my toes back on there, heels together in a little V. I'm going to keep my heels lifted, tailbone heavy, abdomen deepening, and stretch out nice and long. I'm going to inhale, keep my lift, keep my push. As I exhale, integrate my waist ribs as I lower my heels under. Leveraging back ribs to so lift up, inhale. Exhale, resist to go down, hugging my side body in. Again, I never lose my push. Even as I reach my heels under, I keep pushing the toes, keep reaching my head, widening my shoulders, softening those front ribs. One more. Lift up, bend the knees, resist to come in. Then I hold onto my handles, lower my foot bar down, stretch my two legs long, stretch my two arms up. I'm going to inhale, take a full breath in. Exhale, hug my waistline in, reach my arms, one more breath like that. Exhale, this time I'm going to lift my head up, round my pelvis as I float my toes. I'm right into my hundred. You can modify with the knees bending and the head down, or you can lift the head, stretch your legs, and pop in and out. In and out. Lengthening my body on my carriage. Exhale, the able spine, reach my toes. Three more breaths. Two more breaths. the reach as I reach my arms up and lower my two feet back down. I'm going to bend my knees, roll to my side, get my leg springs. Okay, have a seat. Find your way back down. Pick up my springs, bend my knees to my chest, and lift my feet up into my straps. Hardware is always to the outside. I'm going to make sure my tailbone's down. Shoulders anchored, and again, I'm inviting those ribs in. 
expanding in my feet. Feel my chair pose, my strength in my hamstrings here before I even begin, the tautness in the strap before I even begin. And I inhale, pressing, growing, lengthening. And then exhale, deepening belly back, resist the springs back in. Pushing, reaching, exhale, resisting. I'm gonna go four more. Always keep my push. Last one. I'm gonna press out, circle my legs now, six times. Keep reaching into my strap. Keep finding my lift of my spine out of my hips. I'm going to reverse. I'm going to reach down to my seat. Keep that reach. Circle open and back together. Reach. Lift my body. Exhale. Belly to back. Together. Keeping that strong reach. Keeping connection in the back of my pelvis. Hamstrings and glutes start to finish. One more. Reaching, lifting, growing, exhale, circling. And just two times because it feels good. I'm going to keep my point open, my legs flex and pull it in. Point reach open, flex reach, pull it in. I'm going to do one more like that. Exhale, pull it in. Bend my knees, I can take a little happy baby if I want a little extra stretch. And then I'll take the steps off. I'm going to roll to my side. Our stomach massage. Foot bar is up. I have my pad here. I'm going to have a seat. I'm going to add one more spring. Round my back, release my head. Push my carriage out, heels together, toes apart. Think of my frog, feel my connections. Inhale, push out, lower, lift my heels. Exhale, pull in. Down, up, exhale, abdomen in and up. Keeping my push. Keep rounding my back. Take one spring off, reach my hands behind me, open my chest. I'm going to continue here for about eight, inhaling, down up, exhaling. Try to stay on my two sharp sit bones. Find my rhythmic breathing. Keep growing myself taller. Two more. And no support. I keep my sit bones sharp, my heels lifted, my hamstrings engaged. Inhale, I'm going to push out, keep my push, keep my lift. Exhale, pull in. Push, exhale, pull my stomach. Just two more. Take a little twist and rotate. Reach around my plumb line, exhale in. Roll tight, reach around my plumb line, exhale in. One more. Roll, take it taller, exhale. Roll, take it taller, and exhale. Good. I'm going to step off. Continue short box. Box goes over the shoulder block, press this down. I'm going to get my pole. I'm going to take a seat, feet underneath the strap. Pushing out in the strap, strap is taut. Lengthen my body, wrap my hands around my waist, lift my body. Keep my lift as I C curve my spine. Drive the heels under, try to find that C curve. And I'm gonna roll down on an in breath. Stride my legs, reach my heels. Exhale up and over, I'm out breath. Four more, inhale. Strongly reach, lengthen my front body. Exhale, C curves. Inhaling, 
exhale it. Inhaling, get my little waistline in there. Exhaling. Last one. This next time, I'm going to stretch my arms over. Reach my arms up. Exhale. Woo. Feels good. And I'm going to sit tall. Tall back. So the last drop, still taut. And I lift my low back, hug my low belly into that. Reach my arms forward on in breath. Reach over, exhale on the out breath, and just grow my spine. I'm gonna inhale here and hinge back, get tall. Exhale, hinge back. Lift, hinge. Exhale, back. One more time. Lift, keep pulling away. Soften front to back, reaching up, and exhale. Now side bend, I'm gonna lift and side bend. Exhale, center. Lift, side bend. Trying to lengthen evenly through my underside as much as my top waist. Good. Come back center. Release my arms down for a second. Take a breath. Relax anything. Exhale. Reach over for my twist. I'm going to inhale. Fill up. Exhale. Rotate, rotate, rotate. Grow, 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 grow. Inhale. And exhale. Rotate, rotate, rotate. Grow, 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 grow. Keep reaching up into my bar. Keep energetically pulling the bar apart, lifting my spine. One more time, exhale. Empty, empty, empty. Reach, reach, reach. Come center. I'm gonna do one little lap pull here. Open up my chest, stretch my neck, this feels good. And then arms can lower. Take the bar underneath my thighs in tree pose. So for this one, I'm gonna shift back a little bit in my Recline chair, keep my lift, keep anchoring my two sit bones, and pick up my one leg. I'm going to inhale, kick it up, exhale, bend. Inhale, kick it up, warming up my back thigh. And then I'm going to flex, point, point. One more time, I'm going to keep my point, lift, inhale, hinge forward, walk up, bend my elbows and round. I'm going to rock and roll back, try to anchor my sacrum level on both sides, keep my standing legs strong, hug me by the middle. And I pull my stomach in to walk my hands down. And exhale, climb back up. Stable pelvis, stable legs. Reach up to go down. And exhale, climb back up. Belly to back. This time I'm gonna take it into a back bend. I'm gonna keep my reach over my chest. Lift my head, exhale, 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 exhale. Drop and roll back up, inhale. And then figure four, crossing my shin bone over my thigh, leveling out my hips, opening my chest, and exhale, hinge forward. Just feel a stretch in my outer left hip. And gently come out of that. Side two. So try to feel evenness in your two sides. Allow your body to hinge back a little bit. Feel your waistline connect. Hand to hand to hamstring. And inhale, exhale. Try to keep rolling your spine as much as your leg. Pause, point, flex. Keep the point, walk up, inhale, hinging, walking. Exhale, rounding, scooping. And I'm gonna rock back, standing in my left leg, hugging my middle. I'm gonna inhale, reach up to go down. Exhale, C curve my spine, low belly, in and up. Inhale. Exhale. This time I'm taking to a back bend. Go sequentially through my spine. Anchor, stretch, open, on my chin, exhale, scoop my stomach in. In, in, as I climb back up. Woo, rock and roll back to seated. Bend my knee, figure four. That's my foot, press my knee up. Help me open that hip. And I'm gonna exhale, hinge forward. Feel that breath right in here. Good. Optional side bends, I'm going to show you, so if I'm to integrate, I'm going to come to my outer hip here, keep my strap taut, stand on this leg, lace my hands, I'm going to inhale and exhale. I'm going below a side plank and above a side plank. I'm going to go, there's three more. Working my side obliques for two. And one more. I'm going to then touch the floor, reach my top arm over, stretch. Rotate my spine, press down to lengthen my spine, 
And then I want to walk up, hands to box, open my chest, and side two. Feels like a side bend. Strap is hot, hip to sack, hands behind head. I'm going to inhale, and then exhale. Really feeling the work of my side weight, side obliques. Just two more. Supporting my head with my hands for more. Touch down, reach over, lengthen from my top thigh through my fingertips. Then I'm going to rotate, stretch, inhale, exhale, walking up. Hands to box open and spin around. Okay, elephants next. Elephant. With the foot bar, you want two springs. I'm going to stand hand, foot, foot, standing. I'm going to lengthen my spine, broaden my back, and press down to broaden and lift up. Drop bicep to tricep, connecting my side weights. Drive my heels down, and inhale, push out, and exhale, pull in. Seven more, focusing on that low waistline. Heels under, low belly in and up, hugging my middle. Got four, three, two, one. Your best. Five, four, three. Bar targeting my low waist, left waist. Side two, arabesque, hips stay level. Low belly, in and up. Good. And then I'm going to lower onto my knees, pull my toes under for knee stretches. I'm going to keep on two springs. I'm going to lengthen. I'm going to broaden around my back C curve. Already feeling my hamstrings, my seat muscles. Hands pressing, abdomen, ribs lifting. Wrap my triceps to biceps. And I'm going to push out, keep my push, and pull in. Navel to spine. Four. Enhance my seeker. Go belly in and up. Tall back. So I was going to throw my spine a little bit. I remember to keep my floating ribs and my pelvis connected in the front, over my chest, and inhale, exhale. Same idea, low belly. Exhale, low belly. Knees just sliding. Heels keep reaching. Four, three. Now kneeling knees off. I'm gonna find my round again. Press, zipper, pull up. Take a breath in. Exhale, float my knees to a hover. Just my feet. And inhale, push out, pull in. And here's my C curve. I'm going to in and up. Got four. Lightly lower my knees. Whee! Add one more spring. Come to lie down for my run and pelvic lift. Okay, set my feet, anchor my pelvis, engage my weight middle, open my chest. And I'm gonna press out, get long, connected, and lower and lift one. I keep pushing as my heel descends. Start nice and slow. Feel the feet really connected to the foot bar, connected to your body, connected to your back. And then up your tempo. Pelvic stability. Reach the heel out of the back of ribs. Keep softening as you exhale, front ribs in. Four, three, two, one, and then hold the heels up, bend the knees, resist to come in. Arches the feet on, toes open, heels in. Pelvic tilt to lift up. Inhale, push out. 
Exhale, pull in. Push out. Exhale, pull in. Two more. And then roll all the way back down. Slide your knees, feet together. Hug the knees in. You can always end with one more figure four. Right shin over left thigh. Your breath. And then left shin over right thigh. Your breath. And then you can roll to your side. Press yourself up. And there you have it, a beginner reformer workout. Hope that was helpful. And you can look at this time to time and just refresh yourself a great foundation. And you apply this to all the more intermediate advanced exercises. Have a great day, thanks.